Today I've got 14 motors going through one circuit being controlled by a Lego IR receiver. Uh, now a Lego IR receiver wouldn't usually be able to control 14 motors. It would uh, be way too much current for it and it would go into safety mode and, and shut down. Uh, so what I've done here is uh, I'm using the Lego IR receiver to control a relay and the relay is supri supplying the power to the motors from uh, this big LiPo battery and it can handle all that current no problem. So that's what that looks like. You can see the relay light trigger when I turn on the IR receiver. Uh, now, uh, so this relay, if you're not familiar with relays, uh, it's basically just a switch, but instead of having a physical switch that you move, uh, you supply an electrical current to one side and that allows current to flow through the other side and you can use a very small uh, voltage and current on one side and you can supply a very large voltage and current on the other side. So now this, I can handle as much current as I can imagine. Uh, I, I had this power drill motor uh, in parallel with all these here and no problem. Uh, it, it didn't seem to drop in voltage or, and nothing got hot at all. Uh, now there's one problem with this. Uh, there's no speed control or reverse. Uh, but uh, if you've been watching my videos, uh, I've done a few about uh, a, a CVT uh, transmission. So I think that we could have a variable motor on one side and this on the other side and uh, get some sort of power control from that. But uh, I'll work on that. We'll see if we can tame this beast. You know, I'm really not sure if this is practical or not, but it seems like an interesting idea. It seems like it could be applied to LEGO models pretty easily. Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, if you think this is potentially a useful idea, I'd like to hear that. If you think it's just dumb, you can tell me that too. I hooked up the uh, drill motor there too. So there you go, 15 motors. One of them's a big, huge drill motor. Uh, if you ever have a shortage of power, I, this could be your solution, possibly. Thanks for watching.